boys and girls. Today we're going to begin working on our Unit 10, Week 1 Blending. This week we are going to focus on our long U sound. We know that U, when it's a short vowel, it says uh, 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 like an umbrella. But because it's a vowel, the long U can also say its name. So it can say U, U, U when we add a bossy E at the end. Now, the U blank E spelling is also very tricky because not only can it say U, 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 but sometimes it even says Ooh, ooh, ooh. So we're going to work on both of those sounds this week. But first, we're going to start with the cube card where U says U, U, U. And we're going to focus on the U blank E spelling. The U sound in cube is the long U sound. So let's pretend to hold a smooth cube in our hand and say U. U cube. View the smooth cube. This will help us remember the U sound. The sound of U in cube is called long U. It is a vowel sound and the voice is used to make the long U sound. The sound is made at the back of our mouth and our lips are pushed out and our tongue is held high in the top of our mouth. So open your mouth just a little and push your lips forward. Start with your tongue in the bottom of your mouth. Use your voice and move your tongue toward the roof of your mouth. You, you, you. So sometimes we hear that you, you, you sound at the beginning of words, in the middle of words, or at the end of words. So can you think of some words that you might hear the you, you, you at the beginning? Very good. You might think of unicorn or universe or uniform. These are some great words that start with the U, U, U sound. We also might hear the U, U, U at the end. Can you think of any words that end in U, U, U? This one's a little more tricky, but you might think of clue that says U, U, U or new. That one's a little bit more tricky to hear. And then there's also the U, U, U sound in the middle like in cube or huge or human. These words all have the U, U, U sound in the middle. So let's practice blending some words that say U, U, U because of that U blank E spelling. Okay, I want you to sound it out with me and Put it together with me and then watch the video again for a second time on mute so you can practice by yourself without Miss Montiel's voice. Here we go. K you, there's my bossy E telling you to say its name. K you, B, cube. The cube is hard to solve. And this is the same like our cube card. Mmm. You. There's my bossy e telling you to say its name. Ol. Mule. Mule. The mule was so cute. You. Cute. The word is cute. The unicorn was so cute. You. Mm. Now we blend it together. 
fume. And then the bossy E doesn't talk. So the word is fume. The truck was letting out a lot of fume. All right, here we go with our day two blending, boys and girls. We are still working on that U blank E spelling, words that have our U blank E spelling and our bossy E, but this one's a little more tricky because sometimes that bossy E, sometimes it says to say you, 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 like we were practicing on day one with the cube card, but sometimes that bossy E tells the U to say ooh, 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 like in spoon. So that can be really tricky, okay? So we're gonna pretend to eat some soup from a spoon. And you're going to round your lips and hold up the spoon to your mouth and say, ooh, ooh, spoon. And then pretend like you're sipping. We sip soup from our spoon. Learning this action will help us remember that the U blank E can also stand for ooh. So it can say U, 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 like in cube, or it can say ooh, like in spoon. The sound of ooh in spoon is called the long ooh. Our voice is used to make this sound. This sound is made at the front of our mouth. So open your mouth a little and push your lips out. They should form a small circle. Keep your tongue high in your mouth and use your voice and let the air pass over your tongue. <clears throat> and say, ooh, ooh, ooh. If you put your hand in front of your face, can you feel the air? Ooh, ooh. Ooh. Now also, if you put your hand on your throat and you touch your throat, you should also feel it vibrate in your throat there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Can you feel it in both places? That's how we know we're making the sound correctly. Very good. Thank you for making the sound with me. So now, mostly we hear the ooh sound at the beginning, sorry, at the middle of words or at the end of words not really in the beginning of words. So what are some times when you might hear ooh in the middle of words? Like in rule or in cool. That's that ooh sound. And we also might hear that ooh sound at the end of words, like in blue or glue. These are words that we would hear that ooh sound at the end. But for today, we're going to be practice blending words with the U blank E spelling. And this time that bossy E is going to tell the U to say ooh. And then again, that E is going to be quiet because it's so bossy it doesn't even talk itself. It doesn't do its job. Okay, <clears throat> here we go. Blend it with me and then watch it again on mute so you can practice without Miss Montiel's voice. T. Ooh, remember that bossy E telling the U this time to say ooh, t, ooh, n, tune. The word is tune. They were making a nice tune with their band. This one, j, ooh, that bossy E is telling the U to say ooh, n, june, what's the word, june, okay, let's try the next one, l, ooh, that bossy E telling the U to say ooh, l, ooh, Luke. Luke is in Star Wars. T. Ooh, my bossy E telling you to say its name. T. Ooh. B. Tube. The word is tube. My tube 
of toothpaste is almost gone. Very good, boys and girls. Now for day three, it's going to start getting a little tricky because some of our words, the bossy E is going to tell the U to say you, 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 like we practiced on day one. But also sometimes that bossy E is going to tell the U to say ooh, 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 like we practiced on day two. So we have to try and figure out, is the bossy E saying you, 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 or ooh, ooh, ooh. So here we go. Let's just try our best. Great job. So this one just has a U at the beginning. U, s, use. The girl will use the computer. D, ooh. So here, that bossy E is telling the U to say its name. D, ook, duke. The word is duke. The duke was in frozen. So this time, our bossy E is saying U, U, U. Use. So sometimes that S makes kind of a Z sound. It's a little bit tricky, but when it's with the S and the E, it makes a Z sound sometimes. So this word says F use. F use. The word is fuse. The fuse on the firework was really short before it went off. G. Now we have to see, is it going to say you, 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 or ooh, ooh, ooh? D, yoon, hmm, that doesn't seem right. So let me see, that E must be telling the U to say ooh, ooh, ooh. D, oon, dune. The sand dune was fun to ride my bike in. All right, welcome boys and girls to day four. Again, we're gonna be looking at that U blank E spelling when that bossy E tells the U to either say its name, U, 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 or sometimes it says ooh, ooh, ooh. So here we go. J, ooh, my bossy E is telling you to say ooh, J. The word is juke. They were playing some good music in the juke box. Brr. So we have to see, is that saying ooh or you? D. So is it reud or is it rood? I think it's rood. So that bossy is telling the you to say Ooh, brr, you'd, rude, rude. That boy is being very rude. There's my bossy E, so I have to decide. Does it say you or does it say ooh? So d, you'd, hmm, that doesn't seem right. D, ood. Dude, the word is dude. The dude was surfing, hang loose. Brr. My bossy E telling my U to say ooh, rr, ooh, ol, rule. The new rule is to be nice to everyone. All right, boys and girls, here we go with some challenge words. Even though it has already been pretty tricky this week, but you're all doing a fantastic job. Again, we're looking for that U blank E spelling. And if that bossy E is telling the U to say U, 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 or if it's telling the U to say ooh. Let's see. So blend it with me and then you can watch it again on mute to practice by yourself. 
o. That bossy e telling the u. So it could either be f o. We blend those together. Flute. Flute. Hmm. I don't think that's a word. So let me try it with the u sound. F o. Oot. Flute. The word is flute. The flute is a fun instrument. P. Pull. So together the P and the L say pull. Now we have our E, our U blank E, our bossy E. Now what's going to go in the middle? Mmm. So it could be plume. Hmm. I don't think that's a word. So let's see. That bossy e must be telling the u to say ooh ooh ooh. Plume. 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 There we go. The plume is a fancy writing tool. Oh, there's my bossy E telling the U to say ooh. So the F and the L, we blend those together. Full. Ook. Fluke. The word is fluke. It was a fluke magic trick that the dove flew out of the hat. Fluke. So this time that bossy is telling the U to say ooh. Uh, so now we blend those two together. Purr. And then there's my bossy E telling the U. It can either say U or it can say ooh. So it can say prun. Prun? Hmm, I don't think that's a word. Or it can say pr. Prune. Put it together. Prune. The word is prune. We made the prune out of a dried plum. Let's go ahead and read some sentences. Remember my words that are highlighted are the words that are high frequency words that I just have to memorize. I can. Okay, let's sound it out. So I see my bossy E there must be telling the U to say either U or U. So use, use. Remember sometimes that S kind of makes a Z sound. Can I use A? Now we're going to sound it out again. I see my bossy E there telling the U to say its name. K Cube, cube. I can use a cube. Can. Let's sound it out. There's my bossy telling the U to say its name. Ooh. Oh, if it says its name, then it says Luke. Does that Luke? Hmm, I don't think that's right. So the bossy must be telling. The U to say ooh, 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 Luke. Oh, like my friend Luke. Can Luke play? And then I see a question mark, so I have to ask it like a question. Can Luke play? Can you say it by yourself? Great job asking it like a question. Here we go with our next one. We can play on the, and then there's our last word, that bossy E telling the U to say ooh, d, oon, doon. Let's read it all again together. We can play on the dune. Can you read that by yourself? Great job. So 
So here we go. Starting off with the word we need to blend. J. Then I see my bossy E at the end telling that you. If it said you, then it would be j -yoon. Hmm, I don't think that's right. So j -oon. Ah, there we go. June has a... So there's my bossy E again telling that you to say oo k you t If it said oo, then it would say k oot. Is it coot? No. So that bossy E must be telling the U to say you, you, you. K you t I know it's tricky, but you're doing great, boys and girls. June has a cute. This one, I see no bossy E, so that you must say uh, 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 p, uh, p, pup. June has a cute pup. All right, great job, boys and girls, working through those you blank E spelling, you, 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 or ooh, ooh, ooh. I know that was tricky, but you did a great job. Thank you so much.